This isn't just another engine. It's a shot fired across the bow of the entire diesel industry. For nearly 100 years, Cummins stood as the unshakable giant of diesel power. But now, out of nowhere, they've entered the gasoline game with something wild. The B6.7 Octane. It runs on regular 87 octane fuel, packs diesel-like torque, and meets future emission standards with zero diesel complexity. No DEF, no region cycles, just power and simplicity. So why the shift? Why now? And what does this mean for the future of trucks, fleets, and fuel? Let's crack the hood and find out. The Diesel Throne for decades, the name Cummins has been carved into the heart of the diesel world. When people talk power, they talk Cummins. Not because of marketing or hype, but because these engines built the backbone of American industry. From long-haul rigs barreling across icy highways to school buses humming through morning traffic, Cummins diesel engines were trusted where failure wasn't an option. And at the center of it all was one platform, the B6.7. This engine didn't just power vehicles, it powered reputations. It became the go-to choice for medium-duty trucks, delivery fleets, RVs, and vocational haulers. Known for incredible torque, durability, and fuel efficiency, the B6.7 diesel was practically untouchable. Mechanics knew it, drivers loved it, fleets depended on it. When you opened the hood and saw that red block, you knew the job was going to get done. So imagine the shock when Cummins, diesel royalty, announced they were releasing a gasoline version. No DEF, no turbo diesel growl, just regular pump gas. It wasn't just unexpected. It felt like a crown being placed on something entirely new. And for many, it raised a single question. Why would a king risk his throne? Gasoline Shockwave, March 4th, 2025. Cummins quietly posts an update to their newsroom, and just like that, the ground shifts. Their first ever gasoline engine, the B6.7 Octane, is real. Not a prototype, not a concept, a fully certified EPA 2027 and CARB compliant gasoline engine. It delivers up to 300 horsepower and 660 pound feet of torque running on nothing but standard 87-octane fuel. The truck world froze. Cummins? Gasoline? This was the company built on black smoke, big torque, and decades of diesel loyalty. Now they were offering a gas engine that matched diesel grunts and claimed fewer headaches. No DEF, no DPF, no regeneration. Just fuel it and go. Even more shocking? The B6.7 Octane wasn't slapped together to chase headlines. It's based on the legendary B-platform DNA, refined for gasoline. This isn't some lightweight alternative, it's a genuine workhorse. Designed for real-world loads, tested over 2 million miles, and already finding homes in commercial fleets. In one press release, Cummins challenged a century of expectation. The message was loud and clear. They're not abandoning diesel but they are rewriting the rule book. And suddenly, gasoline wasn't the underdog anymore. It was a serious contender. Simplicity meets power. What makes the B6.7 Octane special isn't just the power, it's the simplicity. You get 300 horsepower and up to 660 pounds to it to love out of torque fee. That's serious muscle, even for diesel fans. But this engine skips all the complexity, no DEF, no region cycles, no diesel particulate filters. It runs on standard pump gas, 87 octane, and still meets EPA 2027 and CARB standards. And maintenance? Just once every 15,000 miles. That means fewer shop visits and less downtime. For fleet operators, that translates to lower costs and more time on the road. It's 10 more fuel efficient than other gas engines in its class. So you're saving at the pump too. The B6.7 Octane offers the torque of diesel without the burden. It's an engine designed not just to work hard, but to work smarter. Whether it's delivering goods or moving equipment, this isn't just a gasoline engine. It's a workhorse with fewer headaches. Cummins didn't sacrifice performance, they made it easier to access. 
built for everyone. Cummins didn't create the B6.7 octane for a niche market. They designed it to serve almost everyone. It's already being spaced into Kenworth's Class 5-7 trucks, and that's just the start. Delivery vehicles, work trucks, school buses, and municipal fleets are lining up. The simplicity is a huge win. No diesel exhaust fluid, no active regeneration, just fuel it and go. For city fleets managing dozens or hundreds of vehicles. The maintenance savings alone are game-changing. Take school buses. They operate in stop-and-go traffic, extreme weather, and tight schedules. The Octane handles it all without noise, fumes, or expensive filters. Agriculture is also paying attention. Farm equipment demands power and uptime. With fewer parts to fail and the ability to run cleanly on gasoline, this engine fits right into the rural landscape. The B6.7 Octane isn't limited by category. Its design fits where diesel once dominated, but without the red tape. Cummins built this to fit today's needs and tomorrow's regulations. It's ready to work wherever work is. The Platform Play Here's the real genius behind the B6.7 Octane. It's part of something much bigger. Cummins built it on their new Helm Psar TM fuel agnostic platform. That means the engine shares up to 80% of its components with diesel and natural gas versions. The difference? The top end is customized for whichever fuel you choose. So instead of designing completely different engines for each market, Cummins created one flexible core. That saves money, streamlines repairs, and simplifies manufacturing. It's plug and play, but for powertrains. For fleet managers, this is gold. You can transition to new fuels without overhauling your maintenance systems. You keep the same block and the same parts and train the same techs. And it's scalable. The same modular design can expand into new territories, propane, hydrogen, and even future fuels we haven't seen yet. Cummins didn't just make a gasoline engine. They built an engine that can evolve. It's not just innovation, it's future-proofing. And in a rapidly changing world, flexibility is starting to look like the most powerful feature of all. Under the hood, the B6.7 Octane wasn't slapped together. It was hand-built and fine-tuned in Cummins' Rocky Mount VPI lab. The earliest versions were tested under near-production conditions, not just for power, but for survivability. Could it match diesel expectations without diesel parts? They started with custom cylinder heads designed specifically for gasoline combustion. No borrowed tech here, just precision engineering. The fuel system was tuned for standard 87 octane gas, making this engine accessible and affordable to run. Gone are the complex diesel emission systems. Instead, the octane uses a simple, effective three-way catalyst. No DEF, no sensors, and no active regeneration cycles. Just clean combustion and fewer components to worry about. Oil changes every 15,000 miles. Fewer failures, fewer phone calls, less budget stress. It's not just strong, it's efficient under pressure. Cummins didn't repackage diesel, they reimagined it. The B6.7 Octane might look familiar, but what's inside is something completely new. And if you run a fleet, it's exactly the kind of change you've been hoping for. The bigger game. The B6.7 Octane is just one piece in Cummins' bigger strategy. They know the future won't run on one fuel, so they're building for all of them. Diesel, gasoline, natural gas, hydrogen, and maybe electric too. Their Helm TM platform is more than flexible, it's aggressive. Their new X15N is already disrupting the heavy-duty world with natural gas. Hydrogen variants are being tested, and the next-gen diesels are cleaner, tougher, and ready for 2027. Cummins isn't picking a side. They're laying tracks across every route. While others scramble to meet new emissions rules, Cummins shows up with an engine that's already certified. It's not about replacing diesel. It's about being ready when fuel costs rise. When cities ban certain engines, or when customers demand cleaner tech, the Octane proves they can pivot without sacrificing power. This isn't a gamble, it's a blueprint. In a world moving toward uncertainty, Cummins is offering one thing, options. 
and in transportation, that may be the biggest competitive edge of all. Reactions and Rival Panic the launch of the B6.7 Octane didn't just spark conversations, it ignited the whole boardroom circuit. Forums blew up, headlines ran hot, and engineers at rival companies started watching nervously. Fleet managers saw it first, diesel performance, gasoline simplicity, and a 15,000-mile oil interval. That's not a novelty, that's a budget victory. Operators are already imagining Octanes in their fleets, from school buses to work trucks. Meanwhile, Cummins' competitors are quietly fast-tracking gas engine projects. There's talk of hybrids and hydrogen variants suddenly moving up in priority. No one wants to be left behind if gas engines are staging a comeback. The media's split. Some call it bold. Others call it a betrayal. But no one's ignoring it. Cummins just redefined what it means to innovate in a legacy industry. They've set a new standard and forced everyone else to respond. This isn't about replacing diesel, it's about rewriting the rules for what a work truck engine can be. And for the first time in a long time, gasoline is in the driver's seat. This isn't the end of diesel, but it might be the start of something even bigger. The B6.7 Octane isn't just a gasoline engine, it's a statement, a declaration that Cummins isn't stuck in the past. They're building for what's next. In a world where fleets demand flexibility, where emissions rules tighten and downtime drains dollars, this engine arrives as a solution, not a compromise. Whether you're hauling freight, moving kids, or working fields, the Octane proves gasoline still has game, and Cummins just rewrote the rule book. The king didn't fall, he adapted, and now the road ahead looks wide open.